Hello, this is one of three or four videos I'm making about conditional sentences. This one is about I will if I can, or another example, if I hurry, I'll see my brother. And what will happen if he does see his brother? Hope you enjoy it. We're looking at I will if I can, sentences which are often called type 1 conditionals. And we'll start off with a drawing. It's a drawing here that Caroline did for me of a young man talking to a young woman. And he is saying, I'll just write it here, if I hurry, present tense, I'll see my brother, future, I'll see my brother before he leaves. Or I'll see my brother before he leaves if I hurry. Same thing. And here's another drawing. S same young man, still talking about his brother. Aha, I see a £10 note there. And he's saying, if I see him, I can borrow £10 off him. I can borrow £10 off him. And here's another drawing. Same young man, young woman, this time they're both having a thought, which he expresses and says, if I borrow £10, we'll go to the movies. We'll go to the movies. And she responds to that. And here's the last drawing. This time he's listening to her. And she says, look at that, something nice to eat. She says, and if you borrow 20 pounds, we'll have a burger and chips afterwards. I'll just write, we'll have a burger and chips. I'll just drag in a little chart here to show how it all works. Here we go. Here's the chart. We've got will or can, I will do it or I can do it, followed by if and the present tense, if I have time. Or you can put the whole thing in reverse and say, if I have time, I'll do it. And that's how we make the first type conditional. Now I'd like to have a little test. So I'll just rub all this out, get my rubber going. There we go. And I'll put test up the top here. And I'm going to write a sentence with two options. So go and will go are the two options. And here's the first sentence. I am visit grandma tomorrow. If you today. So first of all, do the first half of the sentence. Oh, sorry. No, I'm afraid not. Wrong answer. Try again. Click here. Yes, well done. That's right. I'll just write the answer in there. I will go and visit grandma tomorrow. Now look at the second half, if you, today. It's not difficult because there's only one possibility left. No, sorry, chose the wrong one. Think again. Click here to try again. Yes, that's right. I'll just write the answer in here. If you go today. Now I've got three options that I'm going to write here for the next sentence, which has three blanks asks, speaks, and will speak. And here's the sentence for you to think about. Think of the first part first. If Ashley to the boss today, oops, no, sorry, wrong answer. Click here to try again. Yes, well done. I'll just write the answer in there. If Ashley speaks to the boss today. Now look at the second one and him to help us. Make a choice. Select from the three possibilities. Whoops, sorry, no, that wasn't the right answer. Click here to try again. Yes, well done. That's right. I'll just write it in and asks him to help us. Now look at the last one, I to him again next week. Uh, 
Oh, no, sorry. That wasn't the right one. Click here to try again. Yes, that's right. I'll just write it in here. I will speak and you have finished. Before you go, just listen to this. Now that you've finished the test, ask yourself this question. How many did I get right first time? You can watch again, now or later. You can take the test again, now or later. Or, if you're ready, you can try something different. And whatever you choose to do, keep a record. It really does make a difference. That's all. Bye for now.